I'd be chefing it up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> ever ever since I watched that panel of catching up with double lift where they started to use cooking it up, ironically, I love saying it just to embarrass people. You know? <laughs> just gotta chef it up there, you know? Let that boy cook. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, are, he's, he's mincing the garlic, he's dicing the onions, it's the so, peppers. It's so funny to see people's like faces of like displeasure hearing me say that. <laughs> you know, let that boy hey. cook, you know? Permission Look, to literally. permission to chef it up, you know what I mean? Oh my goodness, that was a double back fist. <laughs> oh goodness, but you, yeah. If you wanted any character in this game to cook for you, it might be Diddy Kong. He's got peanuts, he's got bananas. You know, he's ready to cook up some like good banana bread with some peanut chunks in there. That'd be nice. Nah, all those ingredients you listed, that sounds like a debuzz meal. Don't you ever say that to me again. <laughs> that sounds like some unappeasing stuff. Hey, ban banana or uh, peanut butter banana sandwiches. All I'm saying. Those you are know, pretty he's good. Just missing the bread. Mm hmm And maybe the bread will be achieved today by winning it out there. So we'll see what Rivers can do. And already starting off strong with that F smash to close it out there. And here's the the movement. Here's one of the biggest problems we're dealing with, Diddy. That character can really just out mobilize you and just make you feel like there's nothing you can do around them. And look at this itemization play, but. The bear not gonna be able to take it just yet, but great jump, great defensive options, and Rivers avoiding it out there. Brad gonna find some way to close it out there, but Rivers, look at this! It's just jumping around the map. Dude, how do you maneuver around Diddy? The answer you might not be able to with such a big body. And I think another thing is just seeing Rivers lay into Brad when they are in disadvantage, not letting him out, and then immediately they're out of disadvantage themselves. Yeah, Brad, he, he's got to find some way to try to pull this back in right now because Rivers is just an unrelenting force, just being able to utilize so much of these tools. Even able to grab the banana, are you kidding me? And now throwing it out there, can't get the confirm afterwards, and the gyro unable to be grabbed out there. But actually, I think it was the fact that Diddy was pulling out banana was actually able to low profile it. Oh, no, Brad. The stock just kind of disappeared, so Rivers in a full event. Did you see the throwing the banana up there to get the gyro away so they can recover back to stage? That was so smart. Dude, I love seeing players like Rivers who have that small understanding because that's not something that you would normally know, right? Because yes, you play Diddy Kong 100% of the time. Well, close to, you still got that craw. But you aren't playing Rob 100% of the time, but you just know that interaction. It's that well studying, but still Brad, studying Rivers' recoveries and finding that kill. And now looking for the kill off the down air. Almost evening up off that one interaction alone. Oh, and really good stuff occurring right now. Rivers, fantastically done. Being able to use these Z-drops in item play that is just putting Brad off on there. Can't be able to utilize too much. Trying to use that back to try to keep Rivers in check, but Rivers just does not care. Utilizing this pressure, even to re-catch both of them. It's, just, it's literally like Bra with a double toss, having able to have two bananas <laughs> out there. Utilizing all items on the board to their advantage. <laughs> the barrel on oh, nah that was the uh, forget biden blast this is barrel blast my goodness <laughs> dude who calls someone out with an option like that rivers that's the only answer rivers built just a little bit different and it's so what do you do as brad if you're gonna keep going in here with rob you just can't use gyro anymore because rivers picks it up and as you said it's double banana now you can't get through it Oh, goodness. And now Rivers in full control of it so far. It's going to be up to Brad to find somewhat solution. And if you made it this far, you'll be able to find some way to pull it out there because that's what you got to do as a player. That's the only option you can do at this point. But Rivers right now is just continuing on that pressure, throwing out the gyro, trying to get that stage control. But it seems like every single time the gyro is thrown out there, Rivers is, you know, quick to hit Brad away from it and continue on forward with trying to get it out there, but even being able to utilize the upbeat, try to get away from it, then great Z drop. The, um, the degree that, that Diddy Kong has to whiff on a shield when the banana is phenomenal, and it's such a huge factor to try to work around it. River showing off exactly what it's done by getting out there with that quick punish and it would take the stock just like that one. And look at this, the damage is stacking up fast and the monkey flips. Brad is just unable to do anything of this sort and the call it as well. Stuck on the right side of the stage, Rivers doing a phenomenal job, still a disadvantage. Brad trying to use an up smash trying to get something out there, but able to finish it out there, Rivers. Oh my goodness. 
Do you remember Brad trying to find that kill? But what can you do at this point? It feels like Brad has to rob against Rivers where you just find these mad early kills because it feels like they can never get a hit. Rivers is just laying out the damage, taking the gyro. And any minute that Brad has gyro or banana, it does nowhere near the amount of utility that Rivers gets out of them. And right now, even though you're in disadvantage, okay, you air dodge got caught by side B, but you're up a full stock right now. This is so hard for Brad right now. And what what do you do, Wolfie? How do you get out of this life scenario now? Well, I, I, you gotta find you gotta find some way to do it because at this point, Rivers. Oh, you talked about robbery early, trying to get his stuff down there, but not high enough percent. And now, Rivers just like congratulations for trying. And now, I have center stage with all this room to play with and trying to get it out there. Straight up air is gonna land as well, but just stuck on this platform. Instant up smash out of there. To make sure there, but Brad, he's gonna find some way to make it happen because Rivers is just continuing on this pressure. I love that bear from Rivers five seconds ago, just to both catch the banana and put the pressure out there. Caught by the up smash, but town and city. Hey, look, that reversal right there, almost popping him into the banana. Good Ooh. gracious. Brad. Brad, he's gonna find some way to try to close this out soon. So it's a really good stuff right now. And yeah, I love it. Grabbing out the banana, trying to get it out there with that down air, but the monkey flip kick. Once again, gonna be such a good option. Try to use that gyro, but it hits against the banana, so it's not gonna be the best way. Not going for the down throw, but the snipe quickly with that laser. Really good stuff, Brad. If he's gonna make it happen, now is a good time to do it. Escaping from that corner and the falling up here, missing out the grab, unfortunately. So Rivers holding on to this state as long as they can, but Brad, really good stuff fighting back. Oh, Ooh, he was trying to cook for a moment, but Rivers. He's got that mental, and he's got it locked down. He ain't gonna let you commit no grand larceny. You're gonna have to take it to a game three and try to figure something out from there. And against Rivers Diddy Kong, looks horrifying. But you know what? Brad really starting to make some good adjustments, finding some earlier stocks. But the worry comes when you are focused on finding early stocks, is how long and how many tricks up your sleeve do you have? So you've shown all your cards. And once your trump cards are shown, Rivers is gonna acknowledge those and play around those. And all of a sudden, those are out of the question. Yeah, hard to pull out the the blue eyes white dragon when you're getting just kind of beat up just like that. So it's gonna be up to Brad to try to find somebody to do it because honestly, the play that Rivers has been doing has just been something of a magical journey at this point. It's just so cool watching this character just move and move. Kind of reminds me of the old Krom days. Honestly, but Brad definitely not out of it just yet, though. But Rivers is just putting in a huge beating. My goodness. Ooh, that monkey flip kick through too. Just a little off on the positioning to cancel it, but oh. it doesn't matter. Banana F smash. Take the one two punch and you are out of here, dog. All of a sudden, already starting off with a stock deficit. This is looking brutal. Oh, it really is. And look at these nares into the aerials and just abusing these platforms as well. It's been a huge factor of PS2, but rolling right into that one. And finally, I'll lend this, the down B as well, trying to get this recovery sniped out there, but not going to work it out there. And it's going to be in, instead a switching of sides, trying to get themselves out of that corner. But Brad, once again, just stuck out there. And look at this projectile game that Rivers is utilizing out there, throwing up the gyro and trying to grab the banana. But it disappeared so unable to work it out there but brad he's gonna find someone to do something because this has been the river show this entire time and look at that i mentioned it from game two that snipe once you've shown some of your aces up your sleeve all of a sudden it's not going to be a surprise river's getting right around that laser kill and now one more trick that's going to be extremely what? hard to pull off but look at that river the up throw catching the banana to get a little bit of extra hit stun for the kill beautiful setup right there that was so smart what i love holding the banana out there and brad just shielding out there because definitely doesn't want to get hit by the banana so rivers realizing that goes for the up throw and goes for the surprise grab knowing that brad was going to hold on to that shield and able to get the kill off but that, that reminder of the hoo-ha moments and it's gonna be able to make it out there with an assist of the banana but at this point rivers with a whole look at this huge lead that this monkey has and Brad, look at the whiff punish degree angle you have up throw up there no way oh 
Oh my right. goodness, Rivers! It was getting up there with a beautiful conversion to not only make it a 3 0, but a 3 stock. What is up with you, my friend? Flow like water in.